Chakra UI provides a default theme object for storing style values, scales, and design tokens. This means that instead of hard coding our CSS values, we can pass some design tokens to color styles, typography, spacing, and more. You can also choose to customize your theme object based on your design system. There's also a variety of colors that come with their color tokens from 0.50 to 0.900. For example, you have red, orange, yellow, green, and a whole lot more. This means that if you're working on a project, you can use chakra colors on your entire site or app. For example, in the UI we built, we can choose to use purple.50 for the light background and purple.600 for the dark purple shade. The default theme object currently supports the following typography keys. Fonts, font sizes, font widths, line height, and a whole lot more. So let's use font size to explain this. You'll notice that each of these values are expressed in the relative unit rem. One rem translates to 16 pixels. This means that if we need a font size of 16 pixels, you can set the font size to medium, which is MD. Similarly, for a 48 pixels font, instead of hard coding 48 pixels as our value, we can simply say 5XL, which is 3REM. This same logic applies to the rest of the typography keys. Chakra comes with a predefined set of commonly used breakpoints. I'll say breakpoints are the CSS widths when you want to work on responsiveness. The breakpoints for small screens is 30 EM, medium screens is 48 EM. So whichever screen size you're developing for, you can simply set the styles at each of these breakpoints. This will make much sense when we learn about how to handle responsiveness using Chakra UI. For spacing, Chakra UI provides out-of-the-box global spacing and sizing scale for your project. You can see that these spacing scales are for padding, margin, top, left, right, and bottom styles. The values of each spacing token is in multiples of 4. For example, if you need a padding 32 pixels at the top, you can simply pass 8, which represents 2M and translates to 32 pixels. Remember, the spacing token doesn't take a unit. It is expressed as a single value like 8, 12, and what you see here. To learn in depth about the default theme and other design tokens, check out the documentation on default theme. In the next lesson, we're going to be refactoring our UI using the default theme objects we just learned about. Thanks for watching. See you soon.